In this DIY episode, we'll be making a Philadelphia Eagles helmet. We'll need spray paint, primer, and clear coat, a drill, sandpaper, painter's tape, and Bondo, not pictured. Some sticker remover. Also, as a final option, Meguiar's wax. I picked up an old helmet on eBay for about $19. As you can see, it has lots of scuffs and scratches. After you've removed the stickers, face mask, screws, and pads, clean them up and set them aside for later. We'll start with the shell. Filling in the scratches with your Bondo, sand down the shell with your sandpaper. Next, cover the helmet with a few layers of primer. My paint skills are lacking, so I won't bother showing you the next step, but you'll want to cover the primer with about three or four layers of your green paint. The final layer is the toughest because your mistakes really show up here. I sprayed about three layers of clear coat. Repeat the steps for your face mask. So I could catch all the angles, I hanged it using a dowel and thread. The pads use the same steps, except I didn't use clear coat here. The gloss paint was enough. Make sure you allow plenty of time for the parts to dry. I waited about a day between steps. Once you've gathered all your pieces, begin to reconstruct your helmet. I picked up all of the decals on eBay for about $25. The decals can be a little tricky, so take your time. If you mess up for whatever reason, you can always grab a blow dryer, set it on low, pull up the decal, and reposition it. strap I picked up at Dick's for about $8 on sale. Once you're done, you have a helmet that looks expensive but didn't tap your pockets too hard. Let me know if you give this project a try. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks again for watching.